Good morning to you. Yeah, well, it's happening with better communication. And this giant snow melter here at the DPW, you know, they're hoping it's a winning combination in dealing with what some are calling a snow crisis in the Elm City. Now, it's not quite the snow dragon, but the city says it's getting the job done here. This industrial snow melter was rented from a Bridgeport landscaper for nine grand for about nine hours. They're working right now on Mount Snow here at the DPW until about eight this morning, we're told the machine machine melts 60 tons of snow an hour. Good news to angry residents. Now the snow and ice packed da packed uh, down on some New Haven streets is now almost two weeks old and folks want it gone. Huge snow banks mean nowhere to park, to drive, and in some cases nowhere to walk on the sidewalk. Last night the city held a special meeting to talk about snow removal with Public Works Director John Prokop. Now city aldermen are hoping to learn from the mistakes made this year, including the lack of community and equipment trouble. I know that we are requiring better communication. And I think from this meeting on, it's going to be better communication. There was a lot that was learned from this snowstorm and the last three snowstorms that we had, you know, and there was a lot of mistakes that was done. In addition to overtime, the city is spending about $1,000 an hour on private contractors to help remove the snow. But the DPW says, heck, it's money well spent when you're able to get rid of all of this snow.